Chapter 15 How do you know if you're ready to make the leap? Quote, All growth is a leap in the dark, a spontaneous, unpremeditated act without benefit of experience. Unquote. Henry Miller Remember the rocket? Scary, right? If you're concerned that you're going to head off into the wrong trajectory, just stop that thinking right now feel better? It's much more important to take action, take a step, make the leap. Pardon me, for I know I just mentioned take a step and then make the leap in the same sentence. In a way, they're the same at the point where we are now, which is, by the way, the very beginning. But the small step, the tiny little movement of a toe in the direction of your dream, is the equivalent of a huge leap to you. Quote, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind, unquote. Neil Armstrong. The secret to this step is just that. It can be minuscule. It can be barely discernible. At this point, it might even be a thought or a change of thought. You might just switch a tiny place in your brain where you used to say, no way, and now you say, maybe. The passion is there, we know that. Check. But it's allowing it to surface. The tiny step, the leap, might be as seemingly insignificant as allowing it to surface, succumbing to the years that it has plagued you, allowing it to exist. Maybe the leap is a different chapter for you. Maybe it could be called the push. I was dragged unwillingly into a 30-day experiment to write every day that scared me so much I was sick to my stomach. Maybe we all need that push. Or pull. Maybe we don't need it. Maybe we know we're ready. A friend pointed me to a podcast about people who make big changes in their lives. Have a listen to The Leap, Episode 4, The Improbable Transformation of a Punk Pioneer https semicolon slash slash goo dot gl slash zwp6qp. Here's an excerpt. So now that I'm working on this podcast about people who make dramatic changes, I'm starting to realize something about them. Many people who leap are not agonizers. They don't spend a lot of time considering the other hand. They're not crippled by regrets. And I just don't get that because I'm a regretter, and for me there is always another hand to worry over, which is probably why I've never played guitar in a genre-breaking band or become a tech executive. Judy Campbell of The Leap I think we're safe to sum it up as a gut feeling. It's much more a decision of the heart over one of the mind. It's not necessarily rational, and it might seem crazy to others, and downright insane to those who don't understand. Do you feel it enough to make the leap? What if we just renamed the leap to a tiny little shuffle of my big toe? Possible. Step. Impossible. Leap. Repossible. Move forward. <laughs>